how to create a eBay seller account. Hi guys, welcome back to another video. And in today's video, I'm going to be telling you about eBay and how you can create your very own seller account. So without wasting any more of your time, let's just jump into the video. So the first thing that I want you guys to do is come over to ebay.com. This is their website. As you can see, it's pretty simple. It's really easy to use. And what you want to do is just simply sign up or register. Now you can sign up or register by clicking on the sign in or register button over here at the top right over here at the top left corner. So simply click on register. And over here, you have two options. You can either create a personal account or a business account. Choose whichever one you want and choose the business account. And over here, just simply enter in your business name, your business email and your password and the locations. And then just simply click on, I only want to buy on eBay. I don't want to sell if that's what you're looking for, but we're not going to click that because we are going to sell on eBay. So I'm going to go ahead and fill out this form and I'll catch you guys in a little bit. So once you have signed up, all you have to do is just simply enter in your username and we can move on. So enter in the username. I'm going to go ahead and enter in my username. Click on continue. As you can see, it's available. And over here, we have to set up our, set up our selling account. So we have to connect the Pioneer account. We have to sync eBay and Pioneer profiles, and then we have to add a credit card or debit card for seller charges, selling costs, and we have to submit registration info. So let's go ahead and get started. So over here, we have to enter in our phone number. And over here, <clears throat> so we have to enter in our phone number and just simply click on next. After that, once you've entered, so once you've entered in your phone number, just simply choose whichever option you want to either text me or call me. Now, cell charges may apply. So once you've entered in your number, just simply enter input the security code that they've sent you and click on continue. So over here, now we now that we have entered in our name and number, now we have to connect our Payoneer account. So let's go ahead and sign up. So if you already have an existing Payoneer account for this business, you can then sign in. But if you don't have one, just simply click on create one. It's really easy. It takes like five minutes to create one. So I'm going to go ahead and sign in my Payoneer account. Okay, so I was having some sort of technical difficulty, but I think I've sorted it out now. So as you can see, I've created my account. Let's just go over here and click on account settings. What I want you guys to do over here is I want you to come over here and click on business information. And over here, just verify everything, your phone number, your email address and stuff like that. Once you've done that, just come over here into payment information and click on payments. And over here, just simply add a payment method. So click on add payment method. And over here, just simply choose credit or debit card. Click on next. And over here, just simply enter in your card number and your card details and simply click on continue. Once you've done that, your payment method will have been secured. So I'm going to go ahead and do that and I'll catch you guys in a little bit. So as you can see, our payment method has been accepted and we are good to go. Now let's go ahead and click on selling and over here, click on seller dashboard. And over here, this is the seller dashboard. And over here we have our account summary. We have our personal information and we have our address, seller account and many, many more. So let's go ahead and click on personal information. So let's go ahead and click on start selling. So over here, as you can see, we have, we have to enter in what we're selling. So we have to enter in the UPC, ISBN, ePaid, part number or product name. So just enter in the product name that you are selling. So let's just assume that you're selling a microphone. So over here, as you can see, we have quite a lot of different microphones that we are selling. So as you can see, we have Rockwell, WRWM, wireless dual handheld microphone system, electro voice microphones, microphone with variable D, and then we have quite a lot of we have this one but it doesn't have any images so as you can see the we have quite a lot of different microphones so let's just assume that we are selling the snowball ice usb microphone so let's just select that and over here we can use this product so let's just use this product as you can see it's creating a draft for us to see and over here we will have all the product details so as you can see we have the title we have the color 
we have the pictures i would recommend that uploading more pictures of the product that you have so that people will know that hey this man has the product and he's and he looks legit and then over here just simply enter in the model number and the maximum spl trend suitor type you can leave that as well and then over here we have additional information you can enter in the color the country of manufacturing manufacturing warranty if you have one and stuff like that or if you want you can leave all of these blank as well and then down below you have description just add a simple description about the product telling you what it's about and what it is used for and once that is done and once that is done you will move on to the selling details over here you can use a auction style or a fixed price if, if you select fixed price then you will have to enter in a specific price that you want to that you want to sell it for so over here we have good till cancelled so over here start my listing when i submit them so you can schedule your listing as well just enter in the price that you want to sell it for let buyers make an offer so if you want to you know let buyers make an offer for you so which can also allow offers to increase of your chance by selling by three to seven percent so if you want to have that option you can go ahead and check this box and then down below you have quantity you can sell that as well and then you have private listing as well so only allow buyers to remain anonymous to other ebay users if you want that or if you don't want it and then you have the payment options over here so you have the paypal payment option you have additional offline payment methods so if you want additional checkout instructions just you know add in your checkout instructions over here and then you have the sale tax percentage if you add that price over here let's just say that we are selling it for like 50 dollars so over here the sale tax should be for for american no no wait for iowa and you can also like add in a percentage of sale tax if you want and then you have shipping details so over here you can add in all of the shipping details that you want so as you can see we have flat same cost to all buyers and then you have international shipping if you want to handle that or not like for if you want to have international shipping then you'll have to get into a little bit more detail but i would recommend that if you do want to sell internationally then that's completely up to you and then you have the option of sell it now and then you also have the option of boosting it so that you can you know sell it faster so you can boost your items visibility with premium placement on ebay and pay only if your item sells so that's pretty good as well and then the and then you have volume pricing so offer a discount when a buyer purchases more than one item at a time which is sometimes a pretty good strategy to get more cash so when it's all done just simply you can go ahead and preview this or save it a draft or directly list the item and then it will be up for sale so i'm going to save it as draft and leave it at that so as you can see this is the price that we sent this is what we're selling and that is basically it so as you can see over here we have quite a lot of things that we needed to do so we did that and i had to tell you quite a lot of things but uh i guess that is it guys and also guys if you wanted to like you know if you wanted to use paypal account you can go ahead and add your paypal account over here as well like it's pretty easy it's the exact same thing you just gotta connect it with your ebay account and boom that is basically it so that's how you basically you know make become a seller on ebay so and how you sell items on ebay as well so i hope you guys enjoyed this video so that is it for this video guys i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did be sure to hit the like button subscribe to our channel and turn on post notifications and having said that i'll catch you guys in the next video and until then take care and goodbye